So in the previous video, we talked about building your LinkedIn story. In this video, we're going to talk about the art of social reciprocity and LinkedIn netiquette. So LinkedIn netiquette is really about the etiquette that you display on LinkedIn. One of the first things that you have to keep in mind is LinkedIn is all about building relationships. A lot of people are on LinkedIn, but they're not LinkedIn. That means that they are on LinkedIn, they build a profile or a story, but they don't do anything with it. The most important thing is to remember that the more relationships that you build on LinkedIn and the more relationships you nurture on LinkedIn, the more success you will have reaching your goals. So just a few things you should keep in mind when thinking about LinkedIn netiquette. Number one, you should connect with people that you don't know, but always remember quality over quantity. Number two, never ask somebody for a favor immediately. Get to know the people in your network and build relationships. And then when it feels comfortable, reach out to people so that they can also feel that they can reach out to you and build that bond and then see if something can happen or if they can help you. When you reach out automatically by asking a favor, it can turn people off and it can make people think that they owe you something. Make sure that you build your profile before you actually start to network on LinkedIn. Remember, unlike a face-to-face -face interaction, it's your LinkedIn profile that is actually communicating who you are. Make sure that you have keywords throughout your profile because it's going to connect you to industry and it's going to connect you to the people that want to find you. LinkedIn is a professional networking site. So the people that are out there trying to build relationships with you are looking at you as a professional. The most important thing is that it's built on your professional story and the professionalism that you display within the LinkedIn platform. Many people will, vi will visit LinkedIn once a month or perhaps every three weeks. That's really not enough if you're trying to build a network. So make sure that you're consistently showing up. If not every day, three or four times a week is sufficient. But make sure that when you are on LinkedIn, that you're actually giving and contributing content because this is going to help the algorithm pick up that you are actually using LinkedIn to establish a network and build a community. So a little bit about the art of social reciprocity. We all know that what reciprocity means. It means giving without the idea of getting something back in return. Social reciprocity is just what we do on LinkedIn, giving without expecting something back. The beauty in social reciprocity is the idea that you become known as a go-giver. And what that means is that you are seen as somebody that wants to give. Liking, commenting, sharing, all of them contribute to the idea of giving. LinkedIn will always give you something as a default. Your URL is a default. Your recommendation requests are a default. And also your connection requests will be simply a default. But you have a chance to change that. Personalization and customization is very important. Anything that you see in LinkedIn that can be customized, make sure that you take that opportunity to customize it. Because just remember, the way that you introduce yourself and the way that you build relationships in face-to-face -face networking has to be transferred on LinkedIn. And the only way that you can do that is to make sure that people are hearing what you have to say. CMA Next. Find your path. Find what's next.